Vise, we will make we will make a start. That was an early bit there. <laughs> Very early. early. Sorry, I'll be new to this. I'm new to this. Me too. Uh, folks, a big good evening to you all. If I haven't met you before, Robert Tolk is my name. Obviously, I'll be taking you through proceedings. And on behalf of our team from Harcourt's Tandem Realty, Mr. Josh Cooper needs no introduction. Uh, in this part of town, he, alongside other members of, team, of his team, have been busy, obviously, maintaining your interest and building your inquiry uh, over the past few weeks. Bernie Bernadette, she's our manager. She's also on hand to help get you into the neighbourhood and across the line for a piece of real estate that has not been sold since you. Now, a lot of you were not even born uh, back in 1974. Probably may have been, but I have a bit borderline. Uh, last time the property actually transacted, it actually was brand new back then. Number 20 Walton Street in Red Beach is how the Postal Service knows it. Formerly, we sell a freehold estate some 809 square metres of the best title of land in New Zealand, lot number 25 on deposit plan. 56638. Uh, the channels are unchanged from the paperwork that's been distributed by Todd and the team. The settlement date that we proffer to you is the 22nd of September, unless you've buried that in writing with agents and owners prior to now. I met with the owners, lovely people, they furnished me with their reserve price completely in line with your feedback and subject to it being reached or exceeded. Uh, once I declare the property on the market, if the hammer comes down in your favour, congratulations, you've done it. Now, if any dispute takes place during the bidding, I'm just going to Determine that or I'll just wind back to the last undisputed level. We'll just move forward from there. Now, always happy to make suggestions as you move through the numbers. Love listening to your suggestions and strategies as well. Now, obviously, if I don't believe that your suggestions are in the best interest of moving the auction forward, I've got that legal right just to push back and to refuse your bid. Um, if you choose not to bid, and I'm well south of my selling threshold, I do have that exclusive right to place what's referred to as a bend or bid, never our preference. Now, always just giving me that ability to provide a bit of a guide or a roadmap for what won't buy the property. Now, if you hear me use the term bend or bid, precisely what I'm doing, and rest assured, it'll always be done well south of my selling threshold. Now, telephone bidders. Two. One, two. Good luck. Hold tight. If you are watching via our streaming service, and being via obviously your Harcourt's uh, representative, just turn the volume down, you'll experience a few seconds delay via the live stream. It can get a little bit confusing and awkward, so again, just look at me, but then take your instructions from the ladies on the telephones, and I wish you well as always. Now, understand that our owners do have the legal right to withdraw their property from sale at any time before the hammer falls to that disclosing that reserve price. Just to give that some context, if I reach the reserve price, I'll share the good news. If I pass the property in here at Harcourt, we don't give you the first right to negotiate post auction. We move straight to our conditional buyer pool. And similarly, if the bidding pauses below my selling threshold, I'll quickly have a private conversation in the first room here with the highest bidder. Uh, please, to everyone else, understand that during that conversation, the owners do have the legal right to withdraw their property, negotiate and sell it without me bringing it back to the floor. So again, folks, you've waited, what is that, 35 years? 45 years, I think it is, 45 years for it to be on the market and available for sale. Folks, if you are here with the benefit of being unconditional, please let me know right from the get-go. The good news, the hammer drops in your favour. Congratulations, you've done it. Todd and I will then take you aside, get you a signed agreement to record the sale. You'll arrange payment for your deposit. That'll be 10% of your successful bid. Pay the balance of funds on the 22nd of September or as per your signed variations. Now, as always, by bidding at auction, you are confirming that you do so on an unconditional basis. You do acknowledge receipt of what's referred to as our buyer and seller's guide. And also by bidding, you're saying you've read the contract and the documentation and you agree to be bound by the terms and conditions contained therein, as well as all of the paperwork that Todd and his team <coughs> have made readily available to you. But that is the boring stuff. A few nice words about the property. Well, again, folks, the opportunity knocks. Uh, it says 650 metres to the Red Beach Surf Club, uh, which is around about possibly, I don't know, 650 steps for Todd and around about 2,000 for me, but thereabouts. Uh, absolutely on the phone here, folks, we offer you up 809 square metres of the best type of land in New Zealand. The property itself, we give you that three bedrooms and two bathrooms of accommodation to get you started on the property. Absolutely move in ready. You can redecorate to taste if that's what you're looking at doing. As well, garaging, well, we have we got a deal for you. Mm -hmm. uh, enough parking for both business and pleasure. Uh, Todd assures me that there is at least four cars, uh, four car garaging and on top of that. Now, the oversized, now I don't want to be incorrect here, man or woman cave also beckons downstairs and folks that's there for you. Guys, I wish you well. Gee whiz, we've waited a while. Good luck, you can't say that we've rushed you. Folks, I've called away for the first time ever for an opening that are off the hood like to get you started. In the room, we're on the phone, so I don't mind something cheap and cheerful or slightly simple. My last option for the day, and it's will be a little bit more expensive. <coughs> Folks, 800000 to get me started if you like, I don't mind. Good place to park a Wrangler, absolutely, sir. Now I'm at $800,000. Well, I sort of had the benefit of seeing the front of the car outside. 800000 locked and loaded, welcome in, good luck. 850 now, surely, I would have thought. 
Should be an absolute sea of hands at 850,000. Yes, good luck. All tight. You look like you're poised with some intention there, Vernon. But at 850, 900,000. Nine now and 50 more. 900,000, that's your opposition. I can square the ledger at a million dollars if you'd prefer. 950,000, a little bit more affordable now, but at 950. And we'll call it 1,000, 1,000, just to make it a bit more palatable. But $1 million and 50 more for freehold land. Not making any more not uh, of it. One million. What do we think, folks? One million and twenty-five. One million and twenty-five. Have to take the small call out. One or two five. That's your opposition. Give you the same courtesy at a million and fifty, or something stronger. And without delay, he says yes. At one o five o and twenty-five more. Take you through to seventy-five. Be the help. Yeah, one seventy-five. One o seventy-five or one seventy. What one o seventy-five? What's the zero? At one million and seventy-five thousand dollars, call it one point one. Yes, without delay, the old binary bit. You're all too young to remember the ones and the zeros. But at one point one, welcome back, and twenty-five more. A lot of property for that. At one point one, on the flat in Red Beach. First chance at one point one against you and the telephones. Bernie, your phone's gone. One down. Twice in your favour, folks. At one point one. One point one. Two five, another one quarter. One million one twenty five. Call one and one eighth of a million dollars. I feel very important when I say it. One fifty, if I can say that, you be well. One million one fifty. One million one fifty. You did, Brett. You're going great. Unfortunately, they're in front, but they're at one million one hundred and fifty. Can I say twenty five more? Bernie's going to write down two numbers and point to the higher one. But one million one hundred and fifty and leading. How are we going on the telephone here, Kat? 1.15, they're waiting. What do we think, folks? Uh, 1.175. Happy to do so. I'm happy to do the mess as well, if you like. But at 1.175, 25 more. 1.2? 1.2. 1 1.2, and bidding well. 25 more, folks. At 1.2, three bedrooms, two bathrooms, 809 square metres. Big decision, I understand that. 1.205. 1.2. Can you make it? Do you want to put two of them together? Call it 1.210. Okay. 1 million 210, I should have asked for it. No, I'm only 1 million 210. Now, so you put up your hand very early in the piece. Do you want to put up your hand now? No, I'll put it at the end. Okay, good. Nice. <laughs> now, 1 million 210, the gentleman that knows what he wants. Now, you can reciprocate it, call it 1 million 220 or something stronger. 1 million 3. 1.3 million dollars. It's a lovely bit at 1.3 million dollars. Going all in, and why wouldn't they into Red Beach? Plenty of people are happy where they did. At 1.3 million dollars. What do we think, folks? Big decision. Reassuring to buy what other people want. You'd pay another 10 surely for the garaging, I would have thought, at $1.3 million. I know you would. At one point three. Ten 10 more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. How you going, Catherine? <laughs> yeah, we'll say yeah, 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 and an option. <laughs> at $1.3 million here, folks. Bear with me. They're at one point three. Bear with me. Thanks for your patience, folks. Big decision, you understand that. Folks, you lead at $1.3 million. My instructions are to put the property on the market and we sell for one something north of there. At 1.3, now folks, I take a thousand or something stronger. What do you think, sir? Funny how it always stops right at that juncture. Everyone has a limit, they may be at theirs. Let's test it. First chance here, and I sell it at $1.3 million. No late bids. Phone is gone. Enemies in the room. Twice at 1.3. 
You may have done it. Third and final time, at $1.3 million, folks, I check it respectfully here. Out. Now's your time. At $1.3 million, folks, at the back, we are selling. Selling. Definitely out. Definitely out. You ready? Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Well done. Cheers, Tom. Congratulations. Right. Yeah. Okay. That'll be in my moment here. Yeah. <laughs>